you are looking at two of the softest minerals around, and that is talc and gypsum. Now, talc is a calc silicate rock, and it is about a one on the most hardness. You can definitely scratch this baby with your fingernail. Um, talc has been used in a lot of industrial applications um, for some time. Um, some talc got a bad rap because it was associated with uh, asbestiform minerals, asbestos. Um, there's a lot of talc mining that was done in California in the United States. Um, I'll talk in excruciating detail about talc in another mineral video that you can find here. I have a minerals playlist, so if you want to learn more about talc, check that out. But just know it's actually really cool. It can have a greenish tinge, whitish, grayish. It's really soft. It feels kind of greasy. And like I said, it's actually a whole different classification of minerals than our other soft mineral, and that is gypsum. Now, gypsum can come also in a lot of different varieties. Actually, gypsum can get impurities and get different colors. This one's fairly clear. A clear variety of gypsum is referred to as selenite. Now, as you can see here, I've been scratching it with my fingernail because it is also really soft, but it can come in varieties that'll render a bit harder than talc. Both of these minerals, though, will be around a one to two on the most hardness scale, making them two of the softest minerals around. Now, we can powder down gypsum, and gypsum also has some industrial applications, but gypsum is also used in the manufacture of drywall. So if you've got drywall, it uses gypsum. There are a lot of different forms, like I mentioned, selenite, alabaster, there's all these different names that go along with it. And again, if you wanna learn all the excruciating details of gypsum, then just check out my minerals playlist and you can learn all about all the different minerals out there so you can identify them and have a lot of fun rock hounding when you know where to find them and what they are. So check that out. Otherwise, I do uh, field trips here, virtual field trips and videos here. So if you want to join me on the next adventure in geology, if you love rocks and this cool planet, then just sub or join me here at Let's Go Geo and I'll see you on the next Geo Adventure.